All right. I'm gonna grab some water. This is very important, and if you can't do this correctly, it's in eighth place. Uh, you need to grab the chain vest. This isn't just for my build, it's just the best item in the game. Chain vest. Yes. If you don't grab it, you've already lost. What about cloak? How do we feel about cloak? Cloak is literally the worst item you could start with because so all of the cloak items are late game. Which is good because we want to win late game, right? No. You want to Wait. win the early game and then win the late game when the late game but, happens. But how can I win the late game if I don't have late game items? I gotta get my water. Grab the chain vest. I'm going for that fucking cloak. Give me the cloak. Cloak or death. What does Albert know? He just came seventh talking as if he didn't say anything. He doesn't have a wireless headset, does he? All right, I'm back with my wireless headset that could hear everything. All right, let's see how you grab the chain vest. If you can't right, do this I'm one basic it. thing, it's an eighth. I'm, I'm going for it, I'm going for it. Uh, grab the Udyr if you can. Oh, Olaf is fine, Olaf is fine. All right, what kind of player do you want to be? Do you want to be a dirty forcer or do you want to be a flexible player? Oh, okay. You're already locked into Sentinel Skirmishers. Congratulations. Oh, oh wait, I got this. I'll watch your stream. No, I just look for another Sentinel, another Skirmisher. Yeah, yeah, you're actually in like such a great spot. The fact that these are your first two units. And then I make a Skirmisher spatula. It's not bad. All right, you should never go six Skirmishers. They just, it's just like, the trade is so weak now. Oh no, I'm going nine. Oh! Yeah! Oh, also, this is really small. Uh -huh. Oh! That's okay. really small. Uh, this is really small, but on these, on spatula starts, loose streaking is actually a very viable option because there's a reasonable chance you get a fawn on the first carousel. But oh. we're so strong, so let's not bother with that. I almost always look to pre-level here if you can, like, if you have units, you're down to give up. I would not give up this two-star Leona. But if Sorry. you get gold, I would uh, pre-level. Uh... Sell the Lux and pre-level. Yeah. Wait, that's great. You got two poppies. Just combine it with the one poppy that you had. Where's the third poppy? I mean... You only I, had to I, sell I, the Lux to level. I, I would gonna play Skirmisher anyway. I, I wasn't going to play Knights. That makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah. Running two two-star Knights at the beginning. We don't, we don't need that. Yeah, no, that's... No, I'm going to win every fight anyway. Did you know... Uh, that knight synergy is for your whole team and not just the knights. I don't know if that was common knowledge, but I only found that out recently. Oh, you're not joking. No, I'm not joking. I actually didn't know that. I, I thought the knights reduced damage on the knights. Hey, look, I'm lost freaking like you said, right? Okay. You, you said the last three. Look at that loss. Only four damage. That, that's that's a good loss. That's a GL. Could you um move your items to the top of your bench? I can't see it because of the... Yeah. yeah. Uh, well. So the worst items you can get with Sentinel Skirms is the rod and then the tier. Blue buff jacks and he jumps a lot. Yeah, sure. He'll look like the PP overheat emote. Yeah, sure. I'm down for blue buff. It's the, the least bad option here. Oh, she came home. So I sell everything and level up to five. Yeah, I uh, sell everything but the Irelia. I'm actually down. Yeah, yeah. Those three is exactly enough. And yeah, yeah. we start win streaking. Yeah, yeah, and make sure to uh -huh. uh, Leo, Knights on the outside. On the you outside. can fix later. There's no way you lose this. Uh, whenever you do like this all frontline position, you mm -hmm. want your uh, squishiest units in the middle because units will attack the closest unit they can see. So the units on the outside are most likely to be attacked. That makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. Yes. Uh, now, do you have a unit that can use a blue buff here? Uh, Poppy. Yes. Uh, it's Poppy or Udyr. Udyr if you two start. Poppy. Okay, Poppy. So hear me. Oh! 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 It's not Skirmisher. We run Sentinel. Uh, I'm down. They are about equal strength early game. So it's just like, if you have like the a two star Sentinel, I'm down. In this case, like either one's fine. Oh yeah, this is nuts. Do we really want to make a blue buff? You don't have to. You're, you're not gonna lose. But, okay, okay, so something to keep in mind. Uh, on yeah. the on a scale from like zero to 10, a uh -huh. five out of 10 item slammed early is equal to a 10 out of 10 item slammed late. Right, because like you, you calculate the value of an item in HP saved. So right now it doesn't matter because you're not gonna, like you're winning rounds, so HP saved is zero. Uh, but in rounds where you might start losing, that blue buff could save you like four HP per round. Right, right, if the blue buff saves you 4 HP every single round, over the course of 20 rounds, it's going to save you 80 HP. 
Uh, the, the item that this most applies to is Sunfire Cape. Okay, so you've got tiers. Uh, it's either Glove or Giant's Belt. Glove or Giant's Belt. Glove mm -hmm. or Giant's Belt. Glove or Giant's Belt. You mean a sword for skirmish or spat? Sheesh! No. Okay. Honestly, that could work. That could work, yeah. Oh, but what happened to you? You used to go for the YouTube highlights. Well, I mean, I go for the YouTube highlights by getting first. I mean, okay, no, what, no, what, no, what you've no, done no. is not bad. Uh, and actually, you... Oh! No. Sorry, you were saying? I was gonna say, Riven is actually a great unit for that Skirmisher spat, because then she gives you Dawnbringer and Legionnaire, and then once you get the Nidalee, you become incredibly powerful. So we should hang on to her. Uh, but Sentinel Senna is fine! This is and fine. And I put a blue buff on her. No. You're going oh. to... You're gonna, you're gonna win anyway. You're gonna win anyway. Right, right, there's right, there's right. no need. Alright, yeah, I don't know what I was thinking. Um, so I have a question. Yeah, what's up? Is there a reason why you made Sentinel Senna instead of Sentinel literally anyone else? Okay. I, I want Sentinel. Right? Grab this cannon. There's like a small chance you run uh, six skirms because we have a spat. I. Uh, but you could put in the Senna and then Skirmisher Puppy. Right? Because, like, she's stronger. Oh, wow. Strong. Wait, okay. Now now, now that was the correct choice. Oh, wait, are you, are you, are you good at this game? But it's, it, you're, you're, you're correct. I, I should have realized that we were going to hit the two-star Senna. Okay, That's now she's point. a really good backline uh, skirmisher unit. I would probably, if you win, I would sell everything but Olaf. You want me to sell my cannon? Yes, because I said Who's we might run. Well, I said we might run six. But that was just like you had extra money and we want to hold the option, but I'm down to oh, just like lock it. Oh, We're yeah. going nine skirmishers. Mm. I, I want you to know that and prepare for it mentally. No. Do you understand what you have to do for nine skirmishers? Shell, shell the right side of your board. When we go nine. You understand that you have to hit level nine to do that. You want to hold this nine gold worth on your bench. Drax! We can go nine skirmishers now. Thank you. Thank. We can go nine. Hopefully, I get four gold. Or even two gold. Wait, Ooh, how many blue buffs? These are so bad. <laughs> These items are terrible. I'm an AP player. I'm an AP skirmisher player. They're gonna itemize for armor. Oh That's my god. That's when I hit them with the reverse Uno card. So uh, what do you think? A, of, what do you take a look at the first place guy? Uh huh. Uh, yeah, probably he's, beat him. he's a little bitch. Yeah, he's a little bitch. Yeah, I was gonna say you could level and put in six skirms now if you wanted to, but you're probably gonna win anyway. I... So these items. How about blue buff rage blade jack? So he's going like. Uh, for now you. you should blue buff Poppy because you're gonna sell her next round. Am Look, I for sure making blue buff? Yeah, fuck yeah. Yeah, and and you are also facing the Mister 100. All right, first place, you little bitch. You could even this go as far so as like he hasn't faced me yet, because I would have ruined his win streak oh, by yeah. now. No bitch, know the difference between me and you. Slamming a Shojin? You think slamming a Shojin? I think I might lose this. I'll be honest, Albert. The more I'm looking what? at this, no, you win. You win. I'm, Put I'm gonna win. Yes, I'm not kidding. Whoa. It's because of Leona. You little bitch, slam that Shojin. You won because you slammed the blue buff. True, true. Good call. That's a good call, coach. All right. Yes, it only costs eight gold, six skirms. Nidalee. Close. There we go. All right. And then you already know. Oh, wait. If you actually want to go nine skirms, you can sell the Irelia instead. And uh, blue buff is definitely best on Jax. Yeah. And then Rage Blade. On Is Senna. That, uh, could you move your items to the top? I can't see the... Oh, right. I keep forgetting, so I apologize. Uh, okay, so it is absolutely not a blue buff Rage Blade. It's, it's a one, of, one or the other. Uh, you are welcome to do a Rage Blade Nidalee if you want. That's, uh, this is like, you're slamming a 5 out of 10 item, but you're slamming it early. Oh, she came back. <laughs> she went for a walk. Okay, all right, now let's talk about your positioning. Look at your units. Are there any units that you feel like are not correctly positioned? Nope. Okay, well, the answer was all of them. Uh, swap Jackson Cannon. 
Okay, now let's move Olaf down left of Irelia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, and then Nidalee down right of Jax. Yep. Oh, no. Huh? Yeah, yeah where, where you were hovering was correct. So uh, here's the reasoning. Uh, you okay. have the Sentinel buff, which rewards you for sharing aggro. The better you share aggro, the more efficient your team comp is. So we put Olaf to the side, like diagonal of Irelia, so that they kind of equally share the aggro. Also, Olaf mm -hmm. is a unit who, if he takes too much aggro, it's really bad because he instantly dies. Uh, so you want to take partial aggro, increases attack speed, and get some sentinel shields. Uh, Kennen wants to be tucked in a little bit safer because you want him to survive long enough to get his ult off. Uh, and Jax, you always want him to get the sentinel shield at ASAP, so you let him take some damage at the beginning. Uh, Nidalee, you just get her close to the front line so that she can go cast immediately. You probably want... Cloak. Yes. Cloak. 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 For Hurricane. Hurricane. Uh, sure. I'm gonna pretend like I'm not going for the cloak and then go for the cloak last second to mentally destroy this kid. But you could have gone for it whenever. Oh, I see. You're like inflicting mental damage. Yeah, so pretending I wasn't going for the cloak. Okay, but yeah, I like it. Rune answer again. Yeah, I'm down. You down? Uh, you doesn't sound like you're down. You seem hesitant to do that. So this Jax doesn't have a way. We have not secured a way for him to stay alive. In my opinion, we should wait for a Bloodthirster or a QSS. Yeah, kind of like, a, are we really going to lose? Oh, he's level 7. Okay, so if you really want to run 9 Skirmishers, I'm not going to stop you. You're the player. I, But I also recommend... Okay, you're... Are we going 9 Skirmishers? Yes. That's... Okay, then then do not grab the Lucian. Just full econ. Wait, it's this possible. guy's going Skirmisher. I want you to know 9 Skirmishers is possible, but it is very, very hard and requires a lot of luck. <gasps> oh my god, Rune and no, Tempest? No, 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 Yes, that's the correct one. That is Aurel so no, 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 no. Oh. Yes, 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 that one. That was that is the perfect one. Yes. Okay. Just put it on Jax and don't even think twice about it. It is so perfect on him. You always want an RFC or GA or QSS on Jax. Now, oh my god. Now you could slam that hurricane if you want. Another very reasonable item to look at is um, Giant Slayer. Wait, I'm losing. What? No, you Wait. don't lose. You don't lose. I'm losing. You don't lose. Oh, God. Oh, Calm God. Calm down. You don't lose. Oh, Look at Jax. God. How did this happen? Oh, Jax. Wait, this is kind of nuts. Um, Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was going to say swap the leasons out. I uh, Buy EXP. I think you might actually hit level 8 without losing econ. Okay. Um, I want to... I think, yeah, it's a cell cannon and I really... We're not three-starring. We're, we need to go straight nine... So that we can fit in nine skirmishers. <laughs> wow, this really was a AP game, huh? And for my next trick, I will put in the best unit you can get is a um, ironclad. But for now, you can just throw in random high value unit. Rakan is not bad. Okay, another unit that can benefit off this skirmisher trade is good. Um, let's go ahead and slam an item, yeah. Okay, so now we gotta think, who can use Rabadons? Because it feels like the game's gonna force us to do that. Although, a very, very good Skirmisher item, the best one that uses a rod is a um, Locket. So, we, we just definitely look for the Chain Vest. This guy might beat you. He's permanently seeing you. Oh. That's bullshit! That, that was bullshit, Albert. Yeah, Hellions is a big counter. Oh, Rage Blade. yeah, if Rage. you want to. Rageblade Irelia is not bad. Do you know why it goes on Irelia? No. It's because uh, she gains damage reduction based on number of attacks. What about we put on Santa because she's all the way in the back shooting? That's, that's okay. That's okay. And then it lets you move it later. I'm down. <gasps> Gwinsu's Nidalee is also pretty legit. Oh, um, Nautilus over Lee Sin for now. Yeah, just give him the team wide buff. But yeah, put Gwinces on somebody. Nidalee. Okay. Nidalee. Uh. <laughs> it's OK. 
okay, because we can build a Rage Blade Senna. Yeah, that's why we got the backup rod. Fucking genius. Fucking genius, Albert. Honestly, like, it's not even your fault. They made Senna, like, unnaturally thick. Oh! Okay, okay. Nico's help. Okay, Let's wait, go. wait, 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 wait. Before Nico's you lock... Nico's help. Nico! I want you... It's, it's fine to do it, but I want you to understand what doing that means. If you are going to roll soon, you should not do it, because you, there's a very good chance you'll naturally hit this, and you could instead save for the Jax 3. Or you can do this right now, and it lets you not have to roll for a while, which is also very good. In fact, I would do it, because you've already hit most of your upgrades. But I just want you to understand, like, what it means when you do that. I have no understanding at all. Well, it just means that we are not going to roll for a while. We are saying that we are happy with our team comp, we need go the last remaining thing, and we move on. We look for level 8, put in something, level 9. And then Come we can on. roll a 9. <laughs> so, how good is the Sentinel buff right now? It's like meh, right? It's meh. It's meh. Yeah. It's meh. You could feel just about replace taking it. it out. I the ribbon is very valuable here. Rod and a teal. Rod and a teal. How about a second blue buff? How do you feel about that? Absolutely not. Uh, it's 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 chain vest any day of the week here. But the blue buff is coming straight to me. Well, we don't care about the distance. We just want the item. The amount Give of walking chain needed. Vest! So you're you're thinking lock. Yes, Locket is incredibly good for skirmishers because your best formation is almost always a line. Uh, you should level up here for sure. We have so much extra money. Well, we'll lose one econ and it will save 20 health. You think I'm gonna lose to anyone right now? Well, it's not just about that. There, There's a very good justification. Oh God, level up! Level up and put in the ribbon. Thank you. You can sell the extra Irelia because there's no way we're hitting through star Irelia at this point. Okay. So, the justification for uh, leveling here... Oh wait, no, sorry. The justification for um, getting stronger, even if we think our level 7 board is going to win, is that we know that there are boards that outscale this. Nine skirmishers oh. is great, but there are boards that will beat this late game. And we need to like kill them now so that they're forced to spend their money and break their economy. Ah, like killing Hitler when he's a baby. Yes, we're going back in time to, like, to save the world. We're, we're strong now. That's a that, you know, that was a great way to like visualize it. Great great work. That's a common trope about killing Hitler as a baby, right? Uh huh. Why not instead bang Hitler's mother and become and his this dad? Way, yeah, <laughs> Hitler is never born. This way, you don't have to kill a baby, and it's like a net positive. Okay. Yes. Yes. Right. That uh, of all the things to do with a time machine, that could be one of them. I don't blame you for doing that. Radiant Disco is kind of nuts. Oh god, oh god, nothing's gonna kill this! Oh no, you win, you win. That war bog! You win. Oh god, oh, You win, relax. God, oh. You won! Why do you lie so easily? We should really take out the setup. <gasps> Replace the wife with the husband. Poor wife, but yes, I think that's correct. <laughs> not, it's not a gender thing for the record. It's just Lucian's a four cost. And... Wait, why did they make Senna a one cost, but Lucian a four cost? Maybe it is a gender thing. I can't answer that one on stream. Oh, we could three star something. Do you see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It night buff and Sentinel is like huge. I, uh, I think you should. All right, pick one of the, your favorite units here between Riven, Nautilus, and Galio to give the skirmisher buff to. All right, Where's and then the rage blade going? Uh, probably Nidalee. You you have a chance of three starring Nidalee. I do. Yeah, you have four Nidalees and an Ecos, and none of your opponents are going for a Nidalee. Right, like when your opponent gets like the Heim Redinger, Ivern, Volibear, Gwen, Fiddlesticks, like that ridiculous Abomination Revenant comp that everybody and their grandma builds late game, with a million CCs and damage and synergies. Uh, how are we going to beat it? You, you, the only way you can really beat it is through overwhelming value. Get a three-star Jax, get a three-star something else. Like, even now we're already, like, kind of losing. We Bro, need to reach I our next get, spike. I can't get past these front lines, man. It's so, it's so cool. Yeah, so we need to call upon... Oh. Hellion Nidalee. So she's super smart. Go, go, go. Go, go. Absolutely not. Uh, something really and funny... Uh-huh. You could do, I, I don't recommend this, but you could do Draconic Emblem 
and put it here for money. But I think it's probably Titans. It's probably Titans on, on Nidalee. Really? Yeah. <gasps> oh, huge. We really like Galio. Yes, because the Knight Synergy is massive for your whole team. All right, so uh, we're, we're approaching the end of the game. I think it's time to just like push for that next spike. So on Carousel, or after Carousel, you probably want to level up and just get one Viego. And then we can finally complete the nine skirmisher YouTube montage clickbait reel. Oh god. Oh no, he has Hyper 2. Nothing beats Hyper 2. Yeah, nothing beats him. I want you to know that there's a decent chance that we, we lose <laughs> with nine skirms. It's, it, it's just that bad. I, I can appreciate how dedicated you are to it, but I just think it's actually that bad. Oh. I'll yeah, you made it as well. Down. Oh, yeah. It's definitely a level 9 next round. Roll down. And then just put in 9 scrims as soon as possible. Now, if you want something that works late game, it's uh, -huh. uh you can do the legendary lasagna. What's a lasagna? Uh, it's where you grab every single 5 cost, and they just like kind of naturally synergize with each other. Garen, Volley, Gwen, Fiddle, Ivern. Yeah, it, they're just like these really tanky units with very powerful AoE CCs. And like, no matter what your base comp is, they will always like add value to it. That That is what you're losing to, by the way. You're losing to like big AOE CCs that there's nothing you can do about it. Your comp cannot do anything about it unless you hit like a Jax 3. Wait, do you win? Oh my, Ooh. almost. You know what? That's a good loss because I'm on the losing streak. That's good for us. Oh, we yeah, wanted yeah. that. Yep. I'm the real winner. Yep. All right. Not only that, but you're richer than them. Oh. <gasps> yeah, I'll stay quiet. Don't worry. This guy is watching the stream. He definitely won't take the thing I like. You stream sniper, bitch. I'm going to kill you. Uh, redemption is the best thing you get here. Okay. Um. You mean red buff? Yeah, Sunfire. You mean, you mean Zeke's? Uh, you mean Deathblade. Zeke's. Zeke's. Sure. Yes, let's get Zeke's. All of those are really bad. So we'll just... Take whatever we can get. All right, let's level up. And we look for that one Viego. Remember to pick up legendary lasagna. Oh, Jax, maybe we three-star Jax. Okay, Viego, nice. Just do nine skirmishers, call it a day. Oh, and set, uh, skirmisher Akshan. Yes, yes. Uh, missing one, Lee Sin. Oh wait, no, yeah, wow, okay, you did it. All right. This is where we pause, champ. This is where we find out if nine skirmishers is actually good. I honestly feel like it's probably trash, but I mean, I, I honestly, I appreciate the fact that you went out of your way to make this happen. Maybe it's decent. If this two star Jax can break through, it's decent. It's trash. Wait, 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 wait. It's decent. Wait, it's decent! I'm the fucking boss! Albert, I feel really like that. It's just because nine skirmishers is garbage. But don't let that take away from your dreams. We, this can work. Now, I hate to say it, but in nine skirmishers, your best unit is the person you put the, the skirmishers badula on. Uh, it's gonna be an Akshan carry game. Akshan's probably actually the best unit because he attacks everybody and he auto attacks so often. Not only that, but he also um, gives you the Sentinel buff, which is very, very reasonable here. Uh, I Since you have a tier, I, you may as well give it to Kennen, let him stun a little bit earlier. Getting that stun a few autos earlier is probably a big deal. What about the Viego? No, because you might deep skill them. Uh... Viego casting a little bit sooner is not as good as Kennen Swing, casting. action, swing! Get out of there, buddy! And he's dead. He's dead. Uh, you can slug. Oh, We're... but look at my Nidalee go. Wait, look at your Jax is popped off. Your Jax popped off. I uh, sell Garen. We're never running him. Never? Yeah, never. We're we're never. committing. We're, we're dying on this hill of nine skirms. Ooh. Okay. Okay. There's a blue buff for Viego. All right. So listen. Uh, yeah, do listening. you see how you can get stronger while maintaining nine skirmishers? What do you think are the ways to get more powerful here? Three star Jax. Yes, that is the obvious one. I uh, upgrade your Lee Sin, upgrade your Akshan, upgrade your Viego. But there's one more. Do you see it? Three star Cannon. Well, I mean three star anyone, obviously. But uh, it's rebuild Nidalee and then move Gwinsu's to Akshan. Uh, move Gwinsu's and Titans to Akshan. It's huge. You want me to give up all my girl Nidalee? Yes. 
if you hit a sixth one. Uh, you should roll. It's the end of the game. You're level nine. Let's roll. After all she's done for, you want us to replace middle. Oh my god! Holy shit! Keep going! Nah, I'm kinda tired. <gasps> okay. Yeah, no, that's fine. We nice Heimer, bitch! I'm about to yoink it! Oh, never mind. It's a different place. Oh, can you? Oh! Not a dough. Can I go? Oh, oh, she's got. Oh, it's her egg. That's it. Yeah, it's fine. I can't oh. believe this is working. Okay, your Jax instantly died. Oh no. Wait, this guy has the too other much super CC. comp. Hellion Lucian. What the hell? This comp is nuts. Your your team didn't get to play the game. It's fine. You get the stimmy check. Okay, I now strongly recommend you roll all the way down. We need two star Akshan, three star Jax, two star Lisa, and rebuild the Nidalee. Your Akshan will become twice as strong once you get these items. Remember, you also have a Nika, so whatever we don't hit, we can just uh, fill in at the end. Don't care about any of those. What's the Stimmy check? <gasps> oh, a Skirmisher Spat! A Skirmisher Spat! Oh my Ooh, god, okay. Keep the Galios. Here's the Nidalee. Oh, Akshan 2, baby! Yes, rebuild the Nidalee! Auction three, 3! We got auction. The... Oh, fuck! Wait, uh, Gwyn sees Titans. Okay, and then just uh, lock it on Kennen. Okay, all right, so... all right, all right. Udia's coming out for sure, right? Yes, she's your worst unit. Uh, and, and we can just what's... put in... For now, you can put in Ironclad. Uh, this guy really zephyred my... Uh... I can't believe the Stimmy check was a Skirmisher oh. spat. Wait, I just realized that Rev that Volley Bear removed every single shield from my entire team. Oh, uh, yeah, this comp is cringe. Wait, okay, one, we have to, wait. We have to roll all the way down. Wait, one unit counters my locket yes, and the, my entire team. The entire, the entire shield. Okay, huge upgrade. Let's keep going. Okay. <sighs> oh, I could have hit a captain. It's okay. Just Everyone focus on your scatter. positioning. Okay, you move your jacks to the back line, but he has that yeah, blue yeah, box, yeah, so worry. he's just gonna he, jump he back in. Up, jump, but he won't get targeted first. True, true, true. I like that. Sway, action, sway, you little bitch. Wait, this actually might be an Akshan diff. Swing! It's an Akshan diff. It's a top three. Okay. Now, luckily, oh, oh. None, of, none of your opponents are griefing you. Uh, what should I get? What should I get out? A Viego Kelby. item. Oh, okay, just yeah. Zeke. Zeke's timer. None of these are good. The other okay option was Morello's, or maybe Last Whisper. Uh, but Akshan is a built-in Last Whisper. You should make sure Akshan and Jax are on the same side. How do I make sure this Bali Bear doesn't remove my entire shield? I think uh, I should spread everyone. I'm thinking a huge spread. Big yeah, spread. Yeah, let, let's roll first. <sighs> Holy shit. Doesn't matter when it doesn't even get to auto attack! Yeah, spread everyone out. Akshan, yeah, 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 there you go. Go! Go! There's no way 3 Star Jax There's loses! No this guy has two Force of Natures! Two Force of Natures! Oh my god, you might actually lose just because there's too much CC. Oh, goodbye shield. Is Jax really gonna lose this? It's actually really close. Go Jax we Beat the shit out of him! You fucking cringe! You're cringe! Okay, uh, maybe I guess roll to see if you randomly hit a, um, rel? Okay. Alright, just focus on positioning. This is the final battle. Don't care about the Zeeks too much. Like, get good cannon synergy, but like, if the Zeeks on, uh... Yeah, you know what I mean? I, I think you should, like, spread out a lot. Remember, this is the guy who has a billion CCs. Uh... I'm not even going to look at his forward, I'm just assuming I'm going the right place. I put it here this way, the cannon will not CC it. 
Unless he jumps on the cannon first thing. Yeah, the cannon first thing. That's okay. Oh, oh he's beating the, the shit! Fight. Oh, he's going after the Tristana! She's dead! Wait, She's this is fucking nice. dead! Akshan's actually doing work. Wait, check the damage chart. Let's go! You did it! You killed you kill you perfectly killed him! Wait, that was nuts! I can't believe it. I, I, I didn't believe you when you said you really want to run nine skirmishers. But now that I've seen an action, I'm convinced that if you didn't go nine skirmishers, we would have won ten rounds ago. But But it's amazing that you made it work. You got yeah, you farmed yeah. the tuber. Yeah, that's a tuber. That's uh that's a tuber. All it took was literally getting a skirmisher spat in the stimmy check. Getting a level five jacks. Getting in the, the literal best item from the Radiant Armory. Uh, and then hitting a three-star Jax! That's all it took! Wait, why don't we just do this every game? And you know what? Yeah, first place. It's yeah, we got win, win, and win. Everybody wins here.